All right, guys, welcome back to Day in the Life of a Reseller. Today is episode two. Uh, we're just going to keep on making these. I hope you guys enjoy them. But let's get right into this. Today, we're going to start off by listing some pairs on GOAT. Uh, so I have five pairs that I'm going to list. I'll show you guys after I list them what I list them for and the shoe. So let's get into it. So this is kind of my setup here. I got a chair and this table where I sit the shoe like this. And then um, I just take pictures of them. So, the shoe's sitting like this. And then I'll take all the, all pictures of angles and size and stuff uh, just from this. I think this uh, wood table's kind of nice. So, I, this is where I take uh, all my pictures for Instagram and Goat and eBay. So, it's kind of nice to be able to easily cross-list all the items. So, we're going to go ahead and get these listed and I'll show you guys everything after I'm finished. Just finished listing on GOAT, uh, so I got them all listed on there. I'll start off with what I've listed. So we got these University Blues in a size 13. I think I talked about these in the last video, but I did post these for 450, I believe. And um, we have these Red Suede 5s, they're pretty beat, but we did post them for like $60, so maybe those will move quick. It's hard to say sometimes though. Uh, we also have these Acapulco Dunks, uh, posted these for $140, they are pretty worn, but $140 for a pair of Dunks isn't too bad of a deal. And, um, right, let's see what we got right here, we have these Fire Red 4s, the NDS OG All Size 5, listed these for $220, I believe, uh, so that's a pretty solid deal. I'm thinking that these will be the first pair to sell out of this, uh, pile, but we'll see, hopefully some of these will sell today. Actually, it won't because today's Sunday, so these won't even get listed on GOAT until tomorrow. But it's okay. We have these Cavalier 4s, size 11. This is my example listing, but I did list these for, I believe it was 230 So, yeah, not bad. Hopefully, some of these can sell this week or so. And, um, yeah, I'm going to continue making these videos if, these, if you guys like these because I enjoy making these. They're pretty easy to make, and um, I think they're interesting. Especially on times when I'm actually doing stuff like on a weekday. It'll be more interesting for you guys, but right now it's Sunday, so it's just kind of a chill day. List some shoes. I am going to take stuff up to UPS today because they are open. So we're going to do that um, in about an hour because they don't open until then. But yeah. Okay, we actually got some good news. We're going to be going to UPS and then the mall because uh, on Friday I went to the mall and they had Raging Bull 5s, so we picked up a pair of those. Never recorded it, but we're going to go back today and see if they have any leftover pairs or if they have any other pairs we could buy to flip for a profit. So I'm going to take you guys along there. And uh, so, yeah, it should be more interesting of a day now. So, um, yeah. All right, guys, so it is a lot later this night. Um, I just pretty much wrapping up the day here. Um, I was not able to go to UPS. So that's not too big of a deal. I'll be able to take those out tomorrow. Um, but yeah, we did end up going to the mall. I'd say it was a success. A success. We were able to pick up two pairs. Um, they're grade school Jordan 1s. I'm going to pull them out for you guys. The uh, highs. They're lows, but you know. It is what it is. I'm going to show you guys. But we did end up getting two pairs of these right here. Uh, we paid $65 each on these. And uh, we're going to be flipping them for uh, $90 a piece. So it's a good profit on each pair. Um, yeah, I just wanted to go to the mall. I didn't film in there because it was like, I don't know. It's just kind of weird to film in places like that. I'm getting better at it though. So maybe film next time I'm at the mall. But didn't do it this time. So um, yeah. Anyways, uh, hopefully those can sell in the next few days. Um, I'm thinking about recording uh, this week, maybe a week in the life, uh, because I'm not going to be able to do daily videos. I know I've posted two in a row, and I think I'm like making daily content now, but I am going to be trying to make more videos. Yeah, I just... Uh, I hope you guys like this type of content I've been kind of pushing out. Not really, I just started posting yesterday. But anyway, I am going to continue to do this. It might just be the weekends or days that I'm free. But I just have two weeks uh, left of school, and then I'll be able to make them like as much as I can. 
I'm gonna have a lot of content for you guys. Um, but yes, so I hope you guys enjoyed this today. Uh, I know it's kind of a shorter one. Didn't do a whole lot, but it was still pretty productive. I don't think anything sold, um, but I do have to package up some orders tonight, and that's going to wrap up my night. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys have a good one, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.